Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to another episode of the Popular Fiction Legacy Challenge. And we come back, we join um, Harrison. I can never remember his name. I always have to try and remember what it is. <laughs> but we join Harrison and Liberty, um, who have lost, they seem to have lost their loving feeling, to quote a famous and very popular song. Um, we need to do something about that because they've got two kids together. So, um, yeah. But we join Harrison and Liberty. It's Harrison's day off. I don't know why he's still in his surgical scrubs. He hasn't changed since he got home yesterday. Um, I was checking uh, MC Command Center to see how many days Harrison has been alive. He's been alive 11 so far, from what I understand. Right? And according to survive an additional 20 days as a vampire that hasn't changed so i'm beginning to think that is glitched but i will keep an eye on it i think i'd mentioned in the last episode that i thought it, i'd i'd been reading it was glitched but you know he's he was made as a vampire so i would have figured that would have been ticking over while he was living but it doesn't seem to be so we'll see how it goes Okay, um, Harrison, what, you are level 9. We have one more level to go. We have one more level to go. Okay, well you can do that then. Because you're quite happy to play. Liberty, you need to see to your children. There you go, your daughter wants a bath. So go bathe your daughter. I've given the house a bit of a makeover. Um, I've changed... The colors in Harrison and Liberty's bedroom. Uh, downstairs is where I've done most of the makeover. Changed the floor, changed the rug, put up some curtains, changed the wallpaper. Cause I just thought it needed to. It looked a bit meh, so I changed it. But other than that, I haven't really done very much. So I see. Let's speed things along. Because I really want him to um to get his pipe organ. Do we have the lot trait where... Oh yeah, it is because he's got the little light bulbs around him. Okay, I've already done that. Let's see how much faster that, give, that makes him learn. Yeah, 15. Yeah, so-so. Alright, he, he could probably keep going until he's... Okay, why are you playing in... Okay. Alright, let's slow it down. You want to listen to Daddy? That's fine. What are you learning then? Oh, she's learning her thinking skill. Okay. And is your brother... Your brother's awake now. He wants a bath. Liberty, come and bathe your son. Uh, take... No. Give bubble bath to Corin. Now the kids have about 20 days because I have everybody on a long lifespan so they've got about 20 days left. So what I will do, I will um, give them at least three of their toddler skills and once they have max three of their toddler skills then they can age up. That is my um, that's my rule for long, long gameplay. As long as they get three of them then they can age up. So, oh, okay, she's only, really? I thought she had her potty skill. Does Corin have his potty, potty skill? He doesn't have his either. I thought the kids had theirs. Okay. Well, we will have to do that then. What is wrong? Oh, you're hungry. Okay, let's see if there's any food in the fridge. Open. Two hours before that spoil. Twelve hours. Let's take that one out instead. Ah, where are we? Countertop. Alright. Go eat your fish. I wonder if you're vegetarian like your father. 
Although we won't really know until um, you get a little bit older. Corin, where are you? You're coming for food, right? You come for your food. And then the two of you are going to have to get potty trained. I thought you had been potty trained. Oh, do we have no more food? Okay, well in that case, let's get... Alright, Liberty, leave him alone, please. Four minutes. Grab a serving. Can you get? Can you grab a serving before it goes off? No, you can't. Okay, all right, leave that. Let's um put that in the sink. Eat the animal crackers instead. No, that's your sister. No. Okay, who just took the animal crackers? Was that you, Karina? She took the animal crackers. Really? Okay, Liberty, you cook for your son then. Um, serve lunch, tofu ta tacos, and you are you are inspired. No, Ira, we don't want to hang out. Let's see how far you're getting on with that skill. Oh, you're halfway through. All right, good. You keep going. Although he's hungry and he needs to bathe, but you keep going. Alright, yeah, I know you're upset because, you know, you're hungry and whatever. But you've got to wait for your mum to finish cooking. That's what happens. That is what happens. So Karina, apart from asserting your dominance... Come and hug your brother. Hug lovingly. And then after you have hugged lovingly, then you can come and grab a serving. I do love it when they hug. It's awesome. Yeah, they're talking about statues that don't move. The big scary things. Right, are you going for food? Yes, you are. Right, you have a call from who? Oh, it doesn't matter. Play dolls? No. Watch TV? No. I just want you to practice. I would really love it if you... Okay, 63%. I would love it if you can max it out before you go and do anything else. Because that would be awesome. All right, Karina, why are you angry from eating dessert? Which dessert did you have? Oh, the animal crackers. It must be. Okay. Um, let's slow that down a little bit. Put that in the fridge. Put those in the sink. And now that's busted. Put that in the fridge. that in the sink what's yeah I don't know what that is go and see what that is and you're gonna use your diaper we really need to work you are watching we need to work on the two of you what do you want to do you want to chat you want to enthuse about space and you want to cook an excellent meal well you can come and repair the sink that's close enough Right, you are almost 76. All right, let's speed it back up. Because I really want him to get it. I know it's really cruel because he, he wants to eat and stuff. But, you know, I really... Oh, Corrin can talk now. You're using your nappy again. I really need to get these two potty trains. I need to bring a potty downstairs. All right, he's been practicing all day. We're almost there, though. We are 88% complete. All right, Liberty, why don't you teach your... No. Yeah, let your kids dance to the whatever they're doing. Oh, they're going to go and play. Right, Liberty, you do that. Harrison. Have you almost... 96... 
Oh, this is like... It's a bit like one of watching one of those finals where you don't want to watch, but you want to watch. Well done. Right. Yep, yeah, go and drink. <laughs> you deserve that drink. You've been playing that for 12 hours, but you did it. Okay, so we maxed out the Vampire Law. We've maxed out Pipe Organ. We need to master... We need to max out the Doctor Career. So he's at level 5. Uh. Okay, we need to see how we're going to get you through this career faster. You need to be focused. No, not interested in my night out at the bar. Alright, I think what we're going to have to do... Does this give out an aura? No. We need to find something. Right, you can sell that. Because, you know, every little bit helps. We need to find something that give, keeps you focused. There is the lamp. We can get the lamp. Uh, what's it called? Would help if I could ca uh, count, if I could spell. Is it a lava? No. Okay. Um, confident, inspiring, romantic, playful, confident, inspiring, focusing. Is that the only one that's focusing? Time travelers? We'll just pick the time travelers one. That's a nice off-white glow. Can that go on? Oh, that can go on this table as well. Cool. So, let's enable that. Yep. And enable. So now you're going to be focused all the time, which is good. Because you need to be focused for work. Do we have enough plasma packs? Was he... How else do we become a Grandmaster? Drink plasma and use vampire powers. Maybe it's time to go out on the town. Let's go and turn some people. Turn the townspeople. Because I think that's going to be our pet project. To go and turn some townspeople. So let's go out to a bar. Where should we go? Should we stick to Windenburg? I think we should. The nightclub. Let's go. Yeah, I think that's going to be our... A little side project to make an undead army. Undead towny army. Who's the deed? Is that Megan? I oh, know it's not... It's, it's not Dr. Megan. Is there anybody here yet? Okay, who do we have? Jade Rosa. Jesse Bland. Uh, Multicolored dreadlock dude. Peyton Stacy. Uh, what are you doing? You are watching. We'll do some dancing. Who's that? Uh, Suzuki. Akito Suzuki. Uh, turn into vampire. No, don't want to do that. And Candy. I think we'll turn her into a vampire because... Uh, I don't know. Just for so. Alright, you're done dancing. And you're hyped. That is awesome. Start turning some townies into vampires. And Joaquim. Should we turn him? Mm, I don't know. Who are you? You're... Oh, you're one of the Heckings. So you just tell him to do it, but... Oh, okay. So I didn't realise that some of them... 
Is it Sotnos? I didn't. I didn't see him. Um, biting Akito's neck. Maybe I missed that bit. Maybe I did. Should we do one more person? Let's do a Sulani. Sulanian? I don't know. Uh, where you gone, buddy? Oh, that's water. Okay. Okay, so you're turning him too. And Joaquin, we will save you. But Candy's got it because... A multicolored dreadlock dude. I like your locks. Let's turn you into a vampire. Because if you're turning all these people then they must be able to, um, that must help. At least it's giving you vampire points. I don't know, we've got three, we've got three power points from that. And Jade, should we? No, I think we'll leave you. We'll leave you alone for now. Okay, what should we spend our power points on then? Uh, we have three, so we can have vampiric strength or vampiric allure. I think the allure will take that. Yeah. Okay, should we go someplace else? I think we should. Um, you're happy because. Oh, okay. One of the toddlers got got level three on their skills. Well, Candy wants money. You'll be able to get plenty of money as an immortal vampire. Why are you sad? From oh, that's from Slice of Life mod. Ulysses. Oh, there's Ira. Is she still pregnant? Oh, she must have had the baby. Oh, he was a vampire. Okay. Who are you? Talk to this dude. We've never known him before. Friendly introduction. How do I get extra people in the club? Because, I mean, eight, pe eight members aren't enough anymore. Okay, that's cool. Um, re request training. Is he a master vampire then? We must be, let me see, our next rank is master. So if you request training from him, he must be a vamp, he must be a master. Or maybe he's whatever the last level is. Grandmaster? Maybe he's a grandmaster. No, they seem to be enjoying it. If you receive training, because that gave him three power points, which is cool. Okay, I think it's probably you napping. He's napping. It's time to go home if you're napping. Okay, so he's back home. He's embarrassed because he's having a breakup thanks to the um, slice of life mod. Why are the twins still awake? Why are they not in their beds? What did we get in the mail? Um, we got sis. Okay, we got seeds. Uh, sell all. So Liberty, you are going upstairs to to clean the bath as you do. Your daughter's happy. All right, we need to do something about the potty skill. Harrison, come upstairs. Let's take one of your children. Um, okay, who's the happiest, or does it not matter? All right, Harrison. You're going to... No, you're not going to nap. Actually, we need you to do dark meditation. Vampire. Dark meditation. And Liberty. No, you're not going to read a book. 
you are going to potty train Corin because he needs those points. All right. So now you and now Liberty, you can know Harrison. You can potty train your daughter, and she gives him a nice big old hug. Yeah, I know you're stinky, but you need to be potty trained, and then we can clean you. So how many undead points do you have now? Oh, you've got three more power points. But we need four for the next level. So we have Vampiric Slumber, Manipulate Light Spirit, Irresistible Slumber, Child of the Moon, and Mesmerize. Okay, I don't know which one we'll take. It's a pity it doesn't tell you how many more how many how much more you need to get to the next level. Alright, is this gonna happen or is there not enough room? Oh no, there's oh there's enough room. That's cool. Okay, she no, he's acquired the potty skill. I thought they had No, but he has it now, right? Oh, he hasn't got it. He's only just acquired it. I, I could have sworn I had potty trained them before. Okay, do we have enough for one more skill? Which would be the child's play one. And um, great acoustics. Okay, we don't need that anymore. Okay, we need um, Child's Play. Not Breeding Ground because we don't need any more. Well, that's the that's the dog one, but we don't need anything else. We want Child's Play. Not Good Schools, Child's Play. Because that is, kids seem to learn faster here. And that would make our life a whole lot easier. And then we could age up the kids a lot quicker. What time, when does Harrison start working? An hour? Yeah. Alright, Corin, you right, you go and sleep. Good boy. And Karina. Now you don't play with dolls, you go and sleep too. And let's join Harrison at work. Alright, Harrison, you go in and Yeah, okay. Right, stop sparkling, thank you. You want to use, you want to do an energized workout. No, we've got to do the usual rinse and repeat doctor stuff. Because for some reason, you know, we haven't graduated from that yet. Okay, examine patient, swab for sample. Okay, Wakim has a wife, I'm guessing. Fatia. So yeah, Wakim now has a wife. Are right, you going? You're going to swap the sample. At least with this job, he finishes earlier now. He's not finishing at six o'clock. Really? After all this time, you're still dropping the swab? Examine. Swap the sample. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Don't wash your hands. You don't need to. Examine. Swab for sample. Can you do it better this time? She's got some kind of stripy tiger disease. Um, examine patient. Scan body. And then um, refer for treadmill test. Okay, let's see how this goes. How much longer? Not much longer. Okay, um, she needs to go back. Didn't we tell her to scan? Didn't we tell him to scan the body? Oh, house call. Yes, let's do that. Because we missed it last time because I messed up. All right, so click on the front desk, go to house call. OK. All right, OK, go inside quickly. Go here. Who's that? That's Nina Caliente. OK, examine and give medicine. Um, more choices. Friendly introduction. I'm guessing she's not the patient. Oh, there's the patient. Examine patient. I don't know what it is with the socks and, and slippers combo. A lot of my 
Sims have always all of a sudden been turned up in a slot socks and slippers combo. Um, yeah, Nina, I think, wants to get to know you as well, which is fine. But we also need to diagnose this guy. Right, do you now know both of them? Yes, you do. Great. And we have, an, we have another sick person up here. Are they, are, the, are they Calientes just living in a random house with all these people? And examine patient, give medicine. And who's, oh, there you go. Examine patient. Yeah, they're all these people just living in a random house. I don't know. Okay, you can give her medicine. You know what? I didn't even check to see how many plasma plaques, pa la plasma packs he has. He doesn't have any. Vampire secrets, order plasma packs. Uh, 50, we can get 10. Did you give him his treatment? Yes, you did. Uh, give medicine and give her medicine. And then that should be the three people that we need to treat. And, oh, I thought that was a her, him, sorry. That's what I get for playing zoomed out. <laughs> I saw the long hair and thought, yeah, woman, sorry. Okay, now Pat's on the back. Now you did a great job, go back to work. Uh, click on the sim and return to hospital. Did you not drink your plasma pack? Okay, he's drinking his plasma pack. We need to analyze the patient sample. Um, more choices. Ah, oh, do we? I guess not. Check patient's eyes and run tests. Oh, I guess lady that was, is that? No, that's a man. Where's the lady we were looking at before? There she is. Compelling, no. Well, she has an illness. Examine patient. Check eyes. Why are you embarrassed? From acne. I'm not loving the fact that from the Slice of Life mod, all of my sims seem to have acne, like every two days or so. Oh, she's no longer covered in stripes. Okay, scan her body. Oh, we did that already. Can we make a... Nope. Compelling diagnosis. Well, she's no longer covered in stuff. All right, can we analyze her? Because we had, we did scan her. Oh, Judith Ward is back. She's a proper celebrity. I thought we had her sample. That must have got lost somewhere. All right, let's refer her for an x-ray scan. Because I want to diagnose her. It's a pity that giving them an x-ray scan doesn't count as scanning a patient's body. Okay, um, examine patient, take temperature, compelling, not yet, examine, check ears, and discuss general health. Okay, can we give medical referral? We've done all of that. What else can we do? I think she might be stuck. Medical referral, x-ray scan. So yet another x-ray scan. Not that it's actually going to do anything. Um, why did... Why is Liberty back at home? Okay, that's, um, that's a bit weird. Liberty only just went to work, but the kids are still at daycare. Alright, that's strange. But we'll sort that out in a second. Examine patient, discuss general health. Guaranteed diagnosis, no illness. Okay, he will end in an hour and scan a patient's body. Let's examine patient, scan body. And his work is excellent. Hopefully we'll be able to get a, a promotion. Why is Liberty at home? That is bugging me more than I really want to, to, um, to think about. 
And we're not getting the usual care for self and all of that. Wait a minute, is Liberty on the lot? She's on the lot. Why are you on the lot? That is weird. Okay, um... Examine patient. Swab for sample. Let's stay late because I want him to get his... I want him to get a promotion. Okay, so we have a sample. Wait a minute, I was being stupid, wasn't I? How many of you were yelling at the computer not to, um, that I need to click on the sample machine and not the computer to check their sample, to analyze their sample? I really wasn't thinking. Hey, there's Mortimer Goth. He was in the line to be, at, um, to be admitted. I wonder if we could, we could find Bella and make her into a, into a vampire. If we see Bella, we will make her into a vampire. Okay, almost finished. Uh, log the analysis results. That you need the computer for. All right, who were we looking at? No. Was it this guy? Yes, I think it was this guy. I'm patient. No, it wasn't him. No, I think it was him. No, it wasn't him either. Um, we've already scanned his body. I scanned him in the x-ray machine. Medical referral. X-ray scan. Okay, he's focused. That's good. All right, he's focused. He came to work focused. He successfully diagnosed and treated two patients. It's in the upper end of uh, excellent. We're halfway. I don't know if that's going to help or not. But we'll see. Because I really want him to get to level six. Okay, that's done. And medical referral. Treadmill test. Are we good? Uh, oh, good. So he's promoted to RN. He can, he gets a doc doctor of medicine diploma. He can now determine baby gender on pregnant sims. His next shift is tomorrow at 7 a.m. and he's got 680 simoleons. All right, he's, yeah, so Liberty, why did you miss work? Um, Harrison, seriously, don't want you to die. I, I'm kind of attached to you. I really don't want you to die. Are these dead? Um, Liberty, you can water them. Okay, and Harrison... Well, if she wants to come and hang out, she could. Have we turned her into a vampire? I can't remember. Right, Liberty, you're watering the plants because they're hard to die, which is fine. And we've reached the end of another day. How, how long have you been alive now? See, command center. Oh, it's still saying 11, though. And it's now Friday. Aging is... Is aging off? On this? I should have checked against Liberty. 21 out of 96. A days till this age up 75. 22. No, it's definitely because before it was 23. But his aging seems to be staying exactly where it is. Number of days lived. That's what I should have looked at. All right, let's see if we can get through till tomorrow and see if the number of days lived has changed. All right, so um, we need to potty train these two. All right, so Harrison, you are talking to Corin. You can potty train him. Liberty is sleeping. I wonder why she came home early. No, we're not going to wake her up. Not yet. And it's summer. Miko, I think we're going to have to turn her into a vampire. She keeps calling all the time. Maybe she's a vampire groupie. I think she might be. Harrison's level four parenting. Uh, Corin, you are... You're still level one potty. Right, you're napping. Well, next time Miko calls and wants to come over, I think we'll turn her into a vampire because I think she's a vampire groupie because she keeps calling all the time. All right, you want to read a book, cook a vegetarian meal, and buy a puppet theatre. No to all of that. Well, read a book, yeah, but that's at the library. We're not going to the library. All right, um, combating a cold. Maybe she came home because she was ill. I don't know. Why are you sad? Oh, low hunger. All right. Um, Liberty. Cook for your children, please. Um, serve dinner. 
vegetable dumplings. All right, Corin, he's upset because why? Oh, potty accident. Well, it happens, buddy. All right, Harrison, you can clean that up. Karina, you want to go hug your mummy? She's cooking. Do we not have a bin in the house? I thought we did. Oh. Okay, we don't have a bin in the house. It's fine, though. And you want to ask Harrison for food because you're sad. All right, Karina can walk properly, almost. She's on level four. So she has... Okay, she has imagination. She has movement. So we're going... We're going pretty well. And Corin, you're still sad from the potty thing. Liberty, are you still cooking? Yes, you are. All right, Karina. No, don't go to bed. Come and get your food. I didn't realise how late it was, though. But yeah, you need to come and get your food. Grab a serving, and you can grab a serving. Because you're probably hungry. Karina, what are you doing? Come back. All right, you can walk through the stairs and get your serving. Liberty is... What's she doing? Oh, she's cleaning the countertop. Right, Corin, do you you're eating. I don't know who's stink oh, maybe it's the countertop that's stinky. That's why he's complaining. Alright, you're still sad. And you want to talk to your dad. Right, that can go in the fridge. You're happy. And you're taking yourself off to bed, which is awesome. And you are taking yourself off to bed. And then mummy and daddy can get some me time. Suave kiss. Um, I didn't see the a kiss actually happening. Did you just... Okay, he... Yep, they've gone to woohoo. I've got autonomous woohoo turned on. But Liberty's like, I can't do this. And he can't do it either. Okay. Word evangelize about vegetarianism and romance check hotness <laughs> that's quite funny yep she's hot she's fainting all right that's good more choices kiss is there a woohoo bush close by i'm not seeing one okay now they're doing autonomous woohoo because i have that turned on in um MC, MC Command Center. So this should prove interesting with my Sims. We might get another baby out of this. But we'll, I think we're going to have to wait and see. Because it's about that time. It's the end of the episode. So, we're going to have to wait till, the, till next episode to see if Liberty is going to have another baby. Or if they're going to be childless for now. So thanks very much for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. It really helps to grow my channel and I will see you guys in the next episode. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye bye.